Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to the channel. My name is Chantel and on today's video, I am excited to show you my back porch, which is in a bit of a disarray at the moment and definitely needs some love. So I thought it would be fun to bring you along as I work on sprucing it up and making it a cozy and inviting space for the spring season. This is, in essence, my back porch. And this is the mess that it is right now, and we're going to fix that. Um, one thing I wanna do on this wall, um, well, I started it yesterday. I'm going to finish it today. There was a bunch of holes. I don't know um, what the people that was living here previously had on the wall here, but all these white marks that you guys see here, those were all holes. Um, so I went ahead. I am so sorry, guys, if you could hear that. I also live not too far from the airport, and airplanes are always flying over. So if you hear the airplane, I am so sorry about that. But I really don't want to do a voiceover, so this is why I'm, I'm trying to um, talk as I film. Anyway, I filled in the holes. So now it is dry. I am going to start out by painting it and then um, I am going to clean up this mess, get all these things out of here, wipe things down, and then we will decorate the area. Okay, so I went to this uh, Home Depot and I got a sample of um, the paint that's on the wall. Hopefully it's a good match. <laughs> And I'm going to paint it over. It doesn't look that yellow. Because this looks yellow to me on the wall, but I'm just going to roll with it. I love them and this one is sprouting from the bottom in here ah, I'm excited but the, unfortunately this never grew any higher than I got it from Ikea but this one did this one had another piece and it sort of like got became yellow and um, looks like it was dying so I just cut it off to keep the plant the whole stem from dying and yeah Look at it. Oh my god. They're so beautiful. Oh.
there's a lizard. I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, as you can see, I have a swing and chair back here. Um, the cushion is, is very filthy. It gets moldy, it's spring, um, and it's not that old. I, this is about three years old, two, about two years old, actually, two, three years old. Um, I bought it from Target. I don't recommend. It came in. Uh, most of these things were frayed out, um, but they did give me a partial refund, so I kept it. Um, I'm just going to put this blanket over it in order for me to hide the, the stains. <laughs> so I like this blanket because it sort of match um, the rest of the furniture in here. I want to add some herbs on it. So let me turn the camera around. I purchased some herbs right here and I'm going to put them in the spot. Now I, I also want to plant some rosemary but I don't have it today so we're just going to find what we have and then um, add it to the stand. Inside of the basket. 
biscuits, I am going to add some faux plants. This is a faux olive tree from, uh, what is this place? Hobby Lobby. Just gonna sit it in here for now. Um, I might add something to the bottom of the basket to give it a little bit of height. Possibly. And then this is a full fiddle tree. Also from Hot Bottom. Now I do want to change out the pillow cases that are in here. I have a few pillow cases. Uh, these some of them I had previously and the only ones that are new to me this year is this one from Amazon and this one from Kirkland. table and on the first one I'm going to just simply add some napkins so that when we're sitting um, back here and we're having a drink or a snack or something these will come in handy these little baskets are very hard to close <laughs> And for the next one, I have some plain cards and a little phone stand, also from Ikea. If I can see that in here somewhere. Again, I am so sorry for the airplanes, but I gotta keep going. I have this little plant that I got. It, it was inside on my counter in the kitchen. I'm gonna bring it out here, uh, hopefully to get a little bit more sun and um, grow a little bit taller. So I'm gonna place that in here. Next, I have some coasters, because we need coasters. And last but not least, I have this um, that I purchased from Target a couple months ago. It was on clearance for like $4 or $5 in here. And um, I'm just gonna place that here and that's it. That is all that I'm going to put on here. 
And I love putting it on a tray because if we need to move it, get it out of the way, we can simply pick it up and put it somewhere else if we want to play games or something on the table. And that is it you guys. I want to thank you so much for joining me today. I hope that you find the video enjoyable and inspiring. And if you did, I hope that you'll go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing to the channel. That way you do not miss any future videos. And also leave me a comment down below as I enjoy interacting with you guys in the comment section. Once again, thank you so much for joining me today. Have a fantastic day and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye guys.